All right, that still fucks me up because I th- I think John Tobias made this game. Z- Cybot is just the most Mortal Kombat word in the world. So, hello, I na- uh, my name is Matthew, and this is Hellbound. <sighs> I think I did like a little video where I talked about this game a long time ago when it was just an endless wave shooter, and their single player campaign is out, which is kind of what everyone wanted in the first place. Um, this had a Kickstarter for it, was a success, and it's out now. Been really looking forward to playing it. I played the demo of the single player campaign like a few months back. I played it for like five minutes and I was like, oh, okay, cool. And then I moved on to something else just because I was busy at the time. So I am happy to uh, get dragged through hell again because we are apparently bound to it. All right, you can see, you see our guy here. He is not created by Todd McFarlane. We might as well like profit. I don't think profit was a Tom and Farrell thing. I think that was that was that was light belt. I don't know. I'm sure people will correct me. But this is our guy. I think his name is like Goreface or Gore Dick. I, it's fine, whatever it is. Let's start campaigning. The resistance. They call me Hellgore, the last of my race. Somehow humans revive me as a weapon against the demons invading Earth. The same bastards that massacred my people. They're sending me back to hell. My planet. Is this is this hell? Or is this a planet that happens to be named Dell? Either way, that's fine. My mission is to destroy the ancient pillars at the core, killing off the teleportation system connecting both worlds. Eh, I'll accept that. That seems fine. Just stop it, we're just an old school first person shooter. This game wears that very, very heavily on everything, its marketing, its options, even that warning at the start. So let's shoot this, just see what it feels like. It feels like that. Uh, not very first, not very old school first person shooter is is an iron sight, but it's welcome. I don't mind that. You kind of have to update in certain ways. I'm just saying. I'm assuming that's armor. It's it's jaggedy and it's green. Most likely that's armor. Can't open it directly. Can't open what? Like a wall? Maybe that's a secret. Oh, let's go behind that then. All right. It's not Little V Mills music, but it might as well be. But let's see if there's anything behind here. Ooh, is this? Is this a thing? No. No, maybe it's not. I maybe need a weapon for that. I'm not sure. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Ooh. Ow! My ass! All right, it's fine. There you go. Oh, shit. Oh, no! How embarrassing. Cut that out of the video, please. And, yeah, we're just there. That's ah, a neat neat little first secret. Gotta have secrets. Do I have any other weapons? Oh, I have, I have punch fists. Yeah, it'd be nice if you threw throughout the right. You don't want to get hit by... Oh, never mind. Left and right clicks. That's pretty good. I don't mind that at all. You can kind of... Kind of Fashion your own combos, your custom combos. Hello, sir. I, I like. I am here invading your your guy's village. Uh, I'm really sorry about that, but uh, the humans. I have to kill the, the core of something, and uh, yeah, Hellbound. I have to say, there's something that that looks really good about this. Um, like, it, is this going to beat most modern games in terms of graphical fidelity? No. But I don't know what it is, but I'm thinking of like a really advanced uh, HD port up of like a Dreamcast game. There's something about the way this looks, and I kind of like it. You weren't really able to see it that much in the uh, wave-based endless mode where, that this game first spawned as. But there's something about this that I, I think looks quite quite nice. It's not super overdone. Like, if this was Doom Eternal, there'd be burning embers everywhere, sparks and stuff. And that's fine for Doom Eternal, but sometimes for a project of this scope, a Kickstarter thing, I think this does the job. New weapon? Uh, maybe? A much... shotgun. What was that? Something something shotgun? It couldn't hear. Ooh, I want to know what the name of this is. Alright, there's a weird demon guy that, ju- that, that just underhand throws a fireball. I don't know if you went from the uh, the imp style school. You never throw a fireball underhand. Never gonna hit shit like that. I'm just saying. Ooh, can I actually get over there? Can I actually jump that? I think I can. I think I can. Okay, only singed my ass a little bit. That's fine too. Ooh, 
Ooh, all these goodies. There you go. I don't know what. Huh. That actually looks like, uh, not the Doom Slayer, but the Doom Hunter a little bit. I'm not sure if that's what they're going for. Most likely it was. So here's a neat thing. You can switch between the left and right side if you are a lefty already. So that's pretty neat. And I read a loading screen tip that actually said, okay. So that's interesting. Um, that's your secondary fire mode for whatever gun you have. So for that, that standard pistol, whatever, uh, the starting weapon, this one, it just happens to be iron sights, but for, oh shit, fuck, uh, for um, uh, the shotgun, it's going to be a triple shot burst. Henceforth the name, triple shotgun. I like that. So the other thing I kind of noticed, kill an enemy. Pulp the enemy further, and then it actually gives you a power up, like a little bit of health there, which is I don't know. That's different. That, that's I, I don't I don't mind that. Yeah, you are wasting a bullet, but eh, you're wasting a bullet. Oh oh, hot 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 hot. So there's you gotta be careful in this opening part. Ow! Oh, in this opening part of the map, there's uh, that lava kills you a lot more quickly than two moons or Mars. Is this? is the most fucked up skybox I've seen all day in a video game. This, that's a 2020 mood right here. I could press E to interact, but I've seen some shit over here. So let's risk potentially finishing the first level to do that. Okay, ooh, what are you? Oh, never mind. It kind of worked itself out. Yay, me! This is an impressive piece of real estate, I gotta say. You know, it's nice to be able to look back on the level you just kind of finished. Still pretty low on health. You know, I'm a, I'm a little worried. There's a new weapon there. Get this heart right now. Wait, is that like a club? It looks like it could be a melee weapon. All right. Yeah, it is. It's the head crusher. Oh, Jesus, you guys up here too. Did not see. I heard gross noises, and I was like, I wonder what those gross noises are. They're not the ones that I usually make. So you can't open it directly seems to be the uh, go-to for this, 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 this door might do something. It kind of looks like it super, super does. So what can we do about that? Yay, what the hell are you? It, that's the save game, sure. Maybe it's like a mid mid checkpoint he is back bitches you guys with clubs i don't know you got the memo but guns okay wow look at that doom map that's incredible uh now now sometimes you have to go to lands and sometimes they're gonna be unholy there's not much you can do about that I'm humanity's only hope. Once the fuckers that took my planet reached Earth, it took all of the resources to fend them off. The fragile humans were smart enough to figure out our teleportation system and send a doomed army for a counterattack. They land on my people's old war worship site, the Unholy Lands. That's my next stop. Wait, your your worship site is the Unholy Lands. Okay. You know, when a game is called Hellbound, it's 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 probably gonna look like this. It is it is living up to what it says on the tin. God damn. So here's the thing. This is not like super hard at all in terms of what's being thrown at you. It's because the damage on everything is so high. It's not so much because of these are you know uh, really high tier enemies or anything. So I'm kind of like, hmm, so you know, you know what I'm saying? So it, it's just that this game is it has the numbers jacked up to a certain degree. I, I wouldn't mind it if it was, it was slightly not that. I know it is supposed to be old school design, I guess. I'm this is like the default the difficulty. He's taking this the bit bitches back. One bitch and motherfucker at a time. Yeah, of course Hal's not going to have flaming barrels or any type of explosives. It's going to have these angry onions. Wait, what? What killed me? Jesus Christ! Was it Father Time? Oh, that was actually pretty cool. That worked out in Helgor's favor. Oh shit! 
Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but so, wait, what? Okay, so whoever killed me before was probably a guy lobbing more shit at my way. Okay, are we good? Are we good? Well, let's experiment on Onion Chan. Okay, th that's what she does. Good. Okay. Well, where the hell? I'll find this red key. Just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. Oh god, what's gonna spawn in there? Holy shit! I saw a little heart somewhere. Oh god, it's there. I'm not gonna risk that. Oh, is this like a permanent health upgrade? What does this do? 25 health. That's the mo most I've ever seen. Damn. You know what a lot of this imagery too just reminds me of, especially like this little window? It's like Mortal Kombat. Big bang of Mortal Kombat off this, which isn't a bad thing. Ah, Jesus Christ. Okay, taken care of. Sorted. What is this? Oh, this might be the end of the level actually. Let me collect this stuff. Okay, I already have that. Let me, because health does not like get replenished after every old school design so let me kill bodies to to loot i guess all right lots more motherfuckers have to be spawning in now there you go uh, uh, oh that was pretty sick all right i think we good i think we have the ancient red key of satan yeah we do that's pretty cool looking Wait, what is that down there? It's like a flaming bird claw? Let me save. <laughs> yeah, I wish quick saves were a little quicker, but it is what it is. Now, before we pick that up, because that's obviously going to do some shit, uh, let us let us go around and pick up anything that we can. Oh shit! All right, so if I go anywhere, there's way too enemy en enemies that get spawned in. So maybe I should actually take this weapon. Maybe I've been avoiding it. And it's actually like quad damage or some shit. Hell damage. Hell damage. Yes, it is literally quad. Da okay, this is a little too bright. It's a little too red. I'm gonna say that right off the bat. It is hard to fucking see anything. Wow. You know, just a slight One red tinge around the sides would do. How damage doesn't need to be I can't see damage. Oh god! Oh, everyone's gonna be tossing fireballs at me from here, I know it. Or is that everyone? I feel like that was a lot. Okay, still so have hell damage, hell damage, hell damage. Can't open it directly, damn it. Ah! Whoa! That was super close. Alright, we gotta be very careful. I don't know what else is gonna spawn in. No one's ever played this far. What am I talking about? Civvy's probably played farther than this. Alright, this is the highest my health has been in a while. I have to, I have to treasure these moments. Ooh, 76! Never been at these heights. So 81! God damn, it's Christmas! All oh, this fucking boss fountain. Just so thirsty I'm at this boss fountain. Okay. Those gross chomping noises are just gonna happen no matter what. Okay, there's some other weird demon that's doing his thing. I don't know where he is. Oh, he's out here, isn't he? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Well, what the hell's hitting me now? Oh, really? I'm full. I'm full up on shotgun ammo. Oh fuck! All right. Well, now, now I'm full up on shotgun ammo. There is a door here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Neat. It gave me one tiny armor shard. Okay, that opened downstairs. Let's just go. Let's just save. Let's just save real quick. Save sc scumming it like a total cool guy. Nine health though. I need help. I need help bad. Ooh, there's one. Thank god. Whew. Man, you're really always managing your health in this, which is, I guess, kind of cool, but it's almost survival horror y. So I don't know what this game's main inspirations are. Obviously, Doom. Uh, but there's some Quake in there, too. But, like, man, I'm always hurting for health. And this is on the normal difficulty. So if you want a challenge. Yay! They're not so unholy now. The Heroes Cemetery. Oh, I think this one be might be where my Kickstarter face is. Operation Payback was a disaster. <laughs> 
just like ours, humanity's forces were massacred, no survivors. At least we got we some got the burial they deserved. Some rocks sprinkled on their own graveyard as tombs. Others were not as lucky. Their amputated limbs and entrails sent back as a message. I have a feeling the demons won't like the answer to that message. Me. I will Amazing. Your sacrifice with their blood. Okay, I will sacrifice them with your blood. What does that mean? Ugh. I just remember something about the Hero Cemetery being where Kickstarter backers' faces. I, I, I don't know whether I opted for that. This game is like a couple years old now. I mean, it's Kickstarter is. So, I might be wrong. Maybe I'm not in here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Are you a Kickstarter guy? You seem important. <clears throat> Maybe you're not, I don't know. Whoa, that guy was cool, I think. It really does look like the uh, Doom Hunter. I uh, you know, maybe... Oh, ooh, ooh, thank you. I'll just raid your tomb. Uh, you know what? Uh, I was saying Doom and Quake earlier, but not really. Now that I think about it, it's like painkiller. This this is essentially painkiller to me. Even if they didn't intend for it, it's, it's kind of how I'm feeling right now. Hey, that's my face! It's You can see right below me! Can't open it directly. Okay. That's concerning. Why is my grave here? Dude, get away, please. Okay, they spawned in. I have to respawn to that spawn. I knew it! I knew he'd be here! I was just thinking it's gotta be this guy! He's right there, and who's this? Dave Oshry, of course! Everyone hates Oshry! <laughs> oh, hey, I found the big, the big board. The board for all the lesser nerds. The ones that aren't as nerdy as the others. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I was low in health there. Alright, there we are, there we are. G-Man lives. I, I, again, I don't even remember if I'm here. So I'm not here, I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I didn't send them my info. I'm so bad about that on Kickstarter. I'm like, sorry, I'll do this later. I can't do it right now, I don't know. I'm gonna forget. That'll do that, I'll do something. We'll see what it does. Moves my little gravestone so I can go in this dank hole. It's not a sewer level, no thankfully. No rest, there's some ass to kick. I live again. Hello, new enemies. Nice. I like that guy. Big chompo face. Oh. oh, they're one hit kills. Okay. Uh, so I think this is a pretty good look at Hellbound. Um, you know, it's pretty fun in general. It's, it's very basic FPS, obviously. There's not a lot going on under the hood other than it's fast. It's uh, fluid and it's fun to kill stuff, which I guess sometimes that's all you need. Um, any other FPSs on the channel I can take a look at? I have been thinking I want to do another uh, three random FPSs because uh, I got some good feedback for that episode. And I have a few in mind I'm thinking for that, but any suggestions I, I could use for some. Uh, so let me know and I'll see what I can do.